Hi there, hello. Uh, welcome to the video for day 44 or 43. I'm not sure. I recorded this video late because I figured I needed time to let my thoughts percolate a little bit. So today, as you saw, the title of the video is called Burning the Boats. I think um, I've gotten to a, to a spot in my life now where I, I definitely need to burn the boats and to commit to... Uh, the finance thing like full because i think what i've been like maybe like attempting to do i've been trying to do like where i have one foot on this side and one foot on the other where i want to do finance and at the same time i'm like oh if that doesn't work out i can always go back to academia and all that but then i think it's time for me to set it up in my head and accept that if this doesn't work then i'm gonna be a failure at life <laughs> Like, I'm just, just going to fail. <laughs> I'm just going to accept that I failed at life. That's, that's it. Uh, because I think that's the only way in which I can, like, fully commit to it and move in a way that says, that, that says not only to me but to the world that I'm actually serious about this, you know? Because I think if you get yourself to a spot where the only way is through there's no other way if you get yourself to, to to that spot both in your mind and in every other possible way it it makes you move differently and i feel like i've i've been moving with too much comfort i've been moving like someone who has got a plan b and i need to eliminate that i need to in essence burn the boats the, the whole idea of burning the boats is like maybe it's like I heard a story of like these guys who were um, in, in ancient times where when they were going to invade a certain place what they would do is they would burn the boats when they arrive on shore which would mean that the only way for them to stay alive is if they stay on the island and defeat the people that they came to defeat so burning the boats is a signal of removing the, the plan B and that's what I, I think I should do you know I should commit myself to say to removing the idea of going to academia because it's not that I, I don't want to do academia but then I think it kills the essence of my soul to, to work it like, like reading papers and not, not that it's something that I couldn't find to be enjoyable but there's more thing there's things that i would love more there's things that call themselves that to me more like working on inventions and 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 just like building things that actually like impact the world you know not that academia doesn't impact the world but i think it's more exciting out out in the real world you know so yeah so i've decided to burn my boats with academia and that after I finish doing my master's degree, I'm not going to do a PhD. Just this, that's just an executive decision that I'm taking. I'm going to go into the real world. I'm going to try to, try to make my, my way through finance. I'm going to try to, to uh, become an actual professional. I'm going to try my hand at, at entrepreneurial things. And yeah, so this is, this is, this is me officially burning the boats Mm -hmm. yeah it's 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 interesting like it's stuff that you think about all the time but then it feels much more real like when i say them in, in videos like this and i put them out out on out into the world like i said with one of my first videos that um once you say it out like this and you put the video out like when i said i was going to be, become a millionaire which i still am I still believe that nothing's changed there it it, it makes it all the more real. It ex makes it all the more serious with myself. So, yeah, burning the bolts. Maybe you can also ask yourself what bolts do you need to burn to remove like, a certain level of comfort that you have with, with the way that you're approaching your goals. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so anyways, I gotta go and, and read stuff about like finance and stuff. These days I'm reading about um, the DCF valuation model, which is like model, which is, which is a model which is used 
to value companies by by people in finance and, 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 and stuff. Yeah, so I've learned a lot about the DCF model. Um, what I still need to kind of get my, to wrap my head around is a little bit of accounting finance or finance accounting. Yeah, so that it ties the whole thing together. So yeah, interesting life, interesting times. Burn the bowls, fellas.